been a solid week. What do you feel like? What's going on? Uh, I feel relaxed, uh, calm. Uh, a lot of the tension is starting to unwind. So is this like, would you go a week before the treatment with this kind of euphoric, healthy feeling or not? No, I was tired and uh, it's tense and like low level anxiety from the from the tension. Yeah. Uh, especially like, like up here. Sure. And then like neck and shoulders, but like more specifically like here and that like this this area. Yeah. So I didn't really get the headaches or the pain, but it was the tension and the anxiety that comes with that. Yeah. And I've noticed now that when I'm like smiling and talking and laughing and chewing, it's easy. It's uh, yeah, and also like I don't like like pretty, say I would go out with friends and like be laughing and joking or whatever. Like halfway through like laughing about something, I would feel the ten the tightness yeah. over here, and I'd have to kind of stop and yeah. be like. So the facial like, muscles feel totally different. Yeah. What about chewing? You know, yeah. swallowing. Yeah, profoundly different. Can you describe yeah. that? It feels like before it felt like I was kind of working overtime to chew food and yeah. then I get tired and I get tired here yeah and uh, it was kind of like a like a, an asymmetrical chewing motion sure because now it's kind of like a like a solid kind of one bite as opposed to kind of like a sliding around so it's more efficient yeah is that a fair statement yeah certainly so before DTR, you had fatigue readily at when eating. Mm -hmm. Now it's fair to say you do not have fatigue. Yeah. Wow. And the fatigue would come in pretty quickly after chewing. Yeah. Like really quickly, like I'd start chewing and then all of a sudden it's just like, I'd slowly I'd slow down and then I'd yeah. like just get tired. How about that tension underneath your mandible? Yeah. I mean, you're not, talking about the I've not had that since. Not since? No, like I would, I would, in the past I would get like cramps, say if I went to your yeah. I would get cramps there. Yeah. And then I'd kind of have like, I'd have to kind of rub it out or like try and close my mouth and sure. stops me from yawning. Sense of the teeth. Let's do that again. Maybe like a one. Mm -hmm. no less, less than a one, yeah. Whereas, if I remember right, you were a seven out of ten before mm -hmm. we here. Yeah. So that's lasting at least for a week. Nice. Mm. It was really noticeable. After the you did the first bit of DTR and then did the swish again, that was like big huge, change. Huge, like that was because it because I'd gone from just doing there was like the smallest amount of time from pre, like the bite change, like yeah. the, the the change was really noticeable because I did them so close sure. together, like sure, yeah, very good. So cold beer, no problem. No, <laughs> nothing. It's fine. So where are you from? England. And why are you here? Because I have a uneven or a incomplete bite. That's what it feels like. Yeah. Um, you told me something about you have a whole lot of tension. Yeah. So it's like my main symptom symptoms would be I would describe as like imbalance throughout the body. So like the imbalance here kind of runs systemic throughout the body and causes like tension which I can't let go of. So it's like always a orthodontic twice. And then I had occlusion equilibrium, which was basically like the ribbon. The equilibration? Bite on, bite on the ribbon and then they kind of guess yeah. where to like go at the enamel. And uh, that really didn't do anything. How many splints did they put you through? Uh, just one. Did it do anything for you? Um, I think it changed my bite, but it didn't improve my bite. I think it just made it more uneven or it didn't address the root of the cause. Can you point to like what the problem is? Where does it feel? Uh, it's not so much like the physical pain as most patients I've seen like have the pain like in the joints. I do sometimes get the sharp pain there. My very first symptoms was ear pain and I went to the GP who said I had fluid in my ear who referred me to ENT yeah. who confirmed there was actually nothing wrong with me. Um, so that was my first like suspicion that it was something to do with my bite or something like that. Uh -huh. Uh, and then... And how old were you when that happened? Um, so I was probably like 21. And you finished your second round of braces? Yeah, so this was just after braces had come off. Got it. Um, and then the other symptoms that I started to notice was like just general imbalance. So I'd like walk into door frames and stuff and like... Yeah. It sounds quite clumsy but like... And my, my, my left ankle was like really unstable and like... Yeah. I would often like trip, trip over my left ankle and stuff like that. And you're not a clumsy guy in general, right? No, so this is like this was all like, I didn't know straight away this was like related to the bite, 
I, I would Google things like uneven bite and stuff, and this was before I even knew what like TMD was. Yeah. Um, and that's how I come to find to find these videos. Do you get headaches or anything like that? If I chew like chewing gum, then I sometimes get a headache, and I've learned to stop doing that. Yesterday, uh, I felt like all the bite was ha happening on this side, like the clenching was happening on this side. And uh, when the teeth did come together, then sometimes these teeth were also like grind together a little bit. That was sometimes happening. So it was kind of like, it wasn't like a solid bite, it was kind of like mm -hmm. sliding together. But now it kind of feels like a, like a nice, like sort of, it's not, I'm not sliding. And it kind of just feels like a more solid. Even. Yeah, it's definitely noticeably something's different. Different, yeah. Very good. Okay. I'd say like me personally, like I was concerned that because I didn't have the physical pain so much, I was concerned like maybe I don't have TMG or TMD. Um, but I'd say like my symptoms were, were more like this physical imbalance in the body and tension. And so, like, if if you think that's you, and it's bite related, then it, it probably is worth considering. Yeah, at least getting looked at. Yeah. In screen. Definitely. Yeah.